Hello. Hi. Uh, I have a question more on the, the concept of Unicron, like the whole thing about sure. him being a whole planet and like really a transformer unlike any other. Uh, how much of him was like your ideas or how much of it was any of Hasbro or no, any of the powers? No, it, it was he... all my idea because I was given write a Transformers feature. Mm -hmm. That was it. That was my assignment. And so I liked the idea of Unicron because I wanted to create something that was enormous and ever transforming, but transforming by absorbing other life forms, other worlds. A, power, a powerful enemy that required normal enemies to unite to defeat that powerful enemy. And I have an interesting Orson Welles story because I knew Orson Welles. Does everybody know who Orson Welles was these days? Well, I, it, good, I'm, I'm glad you do. Anyway, I, I, I met Orson, and uh, before I did, I was working with Lucille Ball. And I said, I'm, I'm gonna meet Orson Welles. She said, well, let me tell you an Orson story. She said, when Desi and I got Desi Lou, Desi said, we're going to need product. We're going to have to create things that are going to be on television. What should we do? Who can we get? And Lucy said, what about Orson Welles? And Desi said, well, that's great. He's brilliant. Where is Orson? She said, he's living at the Chateau Marmont. He's behind six months in his rent. He owes $100,000 to a liquor store and $200,000 to his tailor, who keeps making bigger suits for him because he's putting on 10 pounds a day. And he's also charging hookers and liquor store on credit cards, and he's maxed out. Desi said, let's, let's pay all of his bills and put him in one of our houses in Palm Springs, and then we'll give him some charge accounts there, and he'll write something fabulous for us, and we'll be a hit. That's what they did. Six months goes by, nothing. He's running up bills on credit cards for hookers and liquor stores. Same thing in Palm Springs. So Lucy said, Desi waked me at four in the morning drunk. And he had his gun out. And he said, I'm going to Palm Springs and I'm gonna kill Orson. <laughs> she said, that's not a good idea, De uh, Desi. Get some sleep. He said, no, I'm going. And he drove off. She said, I didn't know for 24 hours if he had killed Orson or not. <laughs> and he returned home. And I said, D did you kill Orson? He said, not yet. <laughs> I put the gun in his nose and I said, you have two weeks to give us something or I'm coming back and I'm killing you. <laughs> Four days later, by limo from Palm Springs, Orson's script was delivered. It was brilliant. They did this show on television. It won every award imaginable. It broke the fourth wall where the characters would talk to the camera, and it was about the fountain of youth. It was sensational. Desi went to Orson with Lucy, and he said, that was just great, but we need more programming. What are we gonna do next? Orson said, Nothing, I'm so tired, I just want to go to Europe and relax. Lucy said it took her 20 minutes to wrestle the gun away from Desi. <laughs> anyway. Thank that, you. you bet. Congratulations on the character of Unicron. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <clears throat>